We've always known that content is king and that's only been reinforced in recent years as the war for attention continues to heat up. Content drives leads, conversions, SEO, go-to-market strategies and it plays a pivotal role in B2B and B2C communications and relationships. But content is nothing if it's not presented in the right context. You might have a kick-ass advert for snow boots, but present that to me in the middle of summer or in a region where the chances of snow are next to zero and that advert is going to have considerably less impact than it would for somebody in upstate New York in December. It has to have relevance. When creating and positioning content, the number one priority needs to be this. When my consumer sees it, are they going to be interested in it or not? And this is where context kicks in. Customers need information when it suits them, when it fits in with their needs and goals at a particular time. If you've got great content but it's not in the right place or being seen by the right people, it's going to fall short. The recent growth in proximity marketing is one such example of context and action. Retailers like Macy's have been trialling technologies that send relevant deals and offers to customers' mobile phones as they enter a store. There are casinos that send members a welcome greeting on arrival and alert hosts to their presence so they can start preparing their favourite drink. There are museums that are using proximity marketing to help visitors navigate around exhibitions and find out more about each display. This is all about location, and as the Internet of Things takes off and sensors are embedded in everything from cars to running shoes, it's only going to become more popular. But context isn't just about location. It's really about having a better understanding of your customer, where they are, what they like, and most importantly, how you can serve them better. That's about data, and the key to marketing success in the future will increasingly lie in how well you align your content with your marketing automation and analytics. Armed with context, you're going to be in a much stronger place to really start understanding your customers. Figure out their likes and dislikes at a particular time and place to a particular proposition, and you'll be on the right track.